Hello, welcome to another video review. Today we've got Super Mario Brothers phone straps. Uh, slightly different scale to the ones we saw yesterday. So uh, here's first one's the Goomba. Uh, yeah, these ones are definitely not legit. Uh, what some of these bootleggers like to do is take existing Mario or existing products at a, at a right size and use it to make a single mold, paint it, and drill a hole in it and put a phone strap thing on it. Uh, yeah, you can clearly see he's fake, but uh, he's cheap, and he still looks decent. I mean, you look at him and you go, yep, yeah, that's definitely a Goomba. Um, and because the easy thing is, you can always repaint it yourself if you really wanted to. So, there's a Goomba. Goomba, Goomba. Uh, molding is not too bad as well. Uh, I mean, it's a line there, a few misprints, paints, but he's, he's okay. We have the uh, Koopa Trooper, which is painted slightly better than the Goomba. Yeah, he's pretty cute. Uh, I just realized I still have Yoshi, and now I'm annoyed and sad. I don't like Yoshi. I want Yoshi. I'm gonna get the Yoshi next time. Uh, Paint-wise, he's okay. Um, he's accurate enough. But sorry, the princess is in another castle. Screw you. Here we go. Here's Toad. You can feel have been waving at you. And he's almost like Mario Party versions of the figures because, uh, you know, they're all waving and being really happy. No one's really mad, apart from Cooper or Bowser, whatever you want to call him. Uh, you see, the paint is just not so good. But the plastic quality is decent. It's not going to snap or break. And that's the important thing when you have a, something like a keychain or the phone strap. Uh, like I said, paint you, so I go with it yourself, but there's Toad, and uh, the, the girl version. And uh, they really didn't glue on her head too well, so you got like a gap there, so uh, we have to fix that. And uh, she's got to be the poo on her leg, but whatever. Uh, winking at you, like, mm -hmm, I'm so adorable. Oh, well, you kind of Girl Toad. Don't know her name. Does anyone know her name? Okay, then you have Princess Peach, not in her Peach outfit, but uh, sports. Ah, this is like the Olympic stuff, I probably. She's a sport outfit, but only she is. Uh, even her leg is a separate piece of plastic. You see like the line where they glue it. Uh, she's sort of rollerblading, but she can't stand because whatever. Uh, she's probably the best painted. It's sort of weird. Uh, all of them have uh, not printed, not painted so well, but the printing on the eyes is really detailed. It must be a separate process. You know, like they print the face and then paint the figure. Uh, her sort of like shoulder pads, elbow pads are painted as well, and uh, knee pads. So you can probably go in and paint those yourself. Uh, then we have Luigi, who has his. Again, really sharp printed eyes, but uh, the rest of the figure is a bit messed up. Even the plastic slightly molding is a bit messed up. Uh, he looks pretty good still. Just needs a bit of a repaint. And um, it's kind of cool that he has his hat off so you can actually do something about that. Next we have Mario being happy, I guess. Uh, again, he's printed also decent, but uh, not the best. He's got a bit of blood. He's been eating Goomba, Koopa Troopers. He's got a bit of blood spewing from his mouth. Uh, chest isn't painted, of course. Bit of plastic there. But uh, he will serve my purposes fine, just fine. Can you stand? No, uh, not that toad. And finally, we have uh, Bowser or Cooper, and he's really badly painted. Uh, but the molding detail is still all there, so like I said, you can do something about that. And he can stand up, so that's good. I share a separate piece that's been glued on, and yeah. He's uh, bleeding from his head because uh, there's a giant metal pin stuck in there. It's like, oh my god, get this thing out! Yeah, I know, that's his hair. Um, he's not even entirely painted, and he's painted so bad that it's just, oh dear. Uh, he didn't even get the uh, print treatment for the eyes, which will look so much better because his eyes aren't like these faces. They're sort of all different shapes and such, so it's gone all weird and funky. But that's that's the uh, Mario phone strap. 
Uh, so what do you guys think of these film straps? They're really cheap for entire sets, so you're not paying too much for them. So uh, would you guys get these? And put them on your phone? Oh no! Oh my god, what's Luigi doing? And Fima tells like winking at it. And Mario doesn't even know because he's such a dweeb. It's a me, Mario, not getting laid for like 50 something years. Uh... So, uh, yeah, sorry about that Italian accent. Um, yep, yeah, Super Mario Brothers phone straps, they're decent for the price, but. Uh, yeah, really. Uh, but the, the cube stuff from the last video was super awesome. So subscribe, suggest, and comment below, and of course take care and have a nice day. Bye!